Greetings, Galactic Earth Angelic to the 144. I am Paul White Gold Eagle from PrimeDisclosure.com. We have a very special transmission from you today from our Divine Brother of the Light, Michael Love, and the Pleiadians. Pleiadian Ascension Teachings, the Divine Light, Pleiadian Light Forces Transmissions, 124 2022. A special message to the star seeds of New Earth. For immediate planetary broadcast. Great one, the Pleiadians are masters of consciousness and grand teachers of the evolutionary process. Tonight we present these advanced and sacred Pleiadian ascension teachings to assist you in your great work. The data stream is encoded with special DNA triggers designed to activate you to higher and higher levels of conscious awareness of what is. The highest blessings and love to all the star seeds of planet Earth. Without you, there would be no light here. You are the light that shines. We give you great honor. Let there be light. Begin transmission. Great one. Planet Earth is going through a major transformation right now, and a magnificent expansion of consciousness is taking place all across this world. The beings of planet Earth are waking up one by one from a long slumber, as the dawning light shines in their eyes. The great awakening of human consciousness was foretold by the ancients and predicted to happen in our modern time, when the light of the great sun would return and shine again on the earth. So what is fueling this new evolution of consciousness? The primary cause behind earth's current transformation and evolution is the increasing levels of cosmic light coming into the planet at this time. Major cosmic cycles are beginning anew, allowing more and more cosmic light to shine again on planet Earth. Light forces in Earth's solar system have been working overtime to assist in deflecting as much of this light as possible down to the planet's surface to help boost Earth's grand evolutionary process. Massive high frequency scalar light waves originating from the galactic core. The central sun are being charged up in the sun's corona then deflected down towards Earth on a frequent basis now. Large amounts of this exotic light has been detected coming into Earth's atmosphere recently, and these waves are showing up in the Schumann cavity of Earth's magnetic field. The Pleiadians say the current level of central sunlight coming into Earth has not been present here for the last 26,000 years, and now is the appointed time to take advantage of this divine light. These scalar light waves vibrate super high and contain packets of intelligent information that transform everything they touch into a higher form. When these cosmic light waves impact the surface of planet Earth, exotic particles penetrate the auric energy field of the human body vessel at speeds of nearly 2 million miles per hour and are then transported into every cell of the body. These high frequency light waves are in the gamma wavelength and resonate between 40 to 100 hertz, which correlates exactly to both the resonance of the fifth dimension and the gamma brainwave state of consciousness. The gamma state of consciousness is an elevated state of being described as a state of ecstasy, bliss, and heaven. It is a state of being where many supernatural abilities begin to operate. What is the mechanical process of ascension and conscious evolution when this divine light makes contact with the layered body system. When this high frequency gamma light enters your cells at blazing speeds, it strips right through the cell and the information packets, particles contained in this divine light carries a literal universal life code that is written over the current sequences of DNA. The entire genome is recoded with a more efficient program. This new higher dimensional code gives new commands to the body and creates new geometric energy pathways. The new enhanced DNA coding instructs dormant DNA strands to return to their natural position in the universal 12D human DNA template. DNA is a biological computer module that receives, stores, and transmits packets of universal life information called light codes which are instructions that create and operate all life. DNA receives and transmits this light to and from the quantum field through a multidimensional chakra portal and transmits this light inside the body via nadis, which operate like tiny fiber optic cables. 
This universal programming code emanates from an unchangeable blueprint or template in the quantum field. All genetic code is written from this universal light code. When higher dimensional light codes carried on cosmic and solar rays from the original universal template is written into the DNA, any dormant strands will reconnect themselves back into one of the corresponding resonant 12 chakra portals or ports. Chakras are non-physical, energetic, multidimensional portals, aka wormholes, in the layered body that form a gravitational grip onto the DNA strand and hold it in place. When the DNA strand is connected back into its proper port, advanced cosmic data starts flowing through the DNA strand, then out through the central nervous system and all throughout the body. Though there are 12 primary strands of DNA filaments, there are trillions and trillions of tiny crystalline gossamer threads called nadis that carry this cosmic energy through the body where it is then decoded and perceived in magnificent ways by the being that inhabits the body. Humanity began as an advanced shining star race in higher dimensions utilizing a perfected 12D human DNA template in place. This divine human is immortal. It cannot be destroyed. It can do all things, it is all powerful, and it has no limitations. This is your divine humanity, and this is where you are returning to. Light is information, and darkness is simply the lack of information. When information is withheld and one has no access to information, they are in the dark, and this is the darkness. When the first two modern earth humans, Adam and Eve, were created around 300,000 years ago by manipulating self-serving creators, 10 of 12 DNA strands were deactivated and humanity was enslaved and plunged into the dark with no information. The good news is when human DNA was unplugged in those ancient days, the strands were left in place in the physical container and now it is literally reconnecting itself with the help of benevolent beings and the light they are sending that matches the human body's original divine blueprint. As more and more high vibrational light reaches Earth, it is triggering a biological evolution. These cosmic rays have entered the crystalline Earth, discharging any ionizing type of radiation that neutralizes, cleans, recodes, energizes, transforms and rebuilds our DNA, allowing all living systems to expand and breathe more light. As the body's DNA is recoded by this incoming central sunlight via Earth's sun, much higher levels of universal data are beginning to flow through the body, creating access to much higher dimensions of conscious awareness. This is the evolution and ascension that is occurring on planet Earth right now. If you have noticed, light seems to be very, very important when it comes to ascension, awakening, and conscious evolution. After 26,000 years of darkness, the Earth is moving back into an area of the cosmos where high vibrational central sun rays are reaching the earth again. Benevolent light forces are here in droves in Earth's solar system, boosting the light coming in, and every major solar observatory on earth has spotted them doing serious work around Earth's sun. Imagine a light ship so huge and advanced it could drain part of the sun's corona off and even send energy into the sun. Is there anything you can do personally to receive much more of this powerful light into your DNA? We say the mystery is in the light, and what you seek is within it. Here is a Pleiadian gift that will boost you along your evolutionary journey faster than anything else. Ancient Advanced Solar Yoga Technology The most powerful Pleiadian ascension ritual you can perform to reconnect dormant DNA strands and expand conscious levels is solar yoga. In ancient times, solar yoga was called Vedic Yoga. Vedic Dharma, Yoga of the Sun, and was referred to as the Yoga of Light by the ancient Lemurians. Have you heard of the sun behind the sun, the hidden sun, or the black sun? There is a literal sun many times larger than the sun, located in the galactic core called the central sun. The sun resonates in the fifth dimension and is not such a 3D thing. Ancient races spoke about a hidden aspect to the light of the sun, Mystical and spiritual traditions from nearly every culture have linked the sun to man's higher evolution. Cultures as diverse as the Essenes, the Mayan, Aztecs, Buddhists, Hindus, 
oceanic tribes, and Native Americans all link the power of the sun to man's higher nature. According to these ancient traditions, the hidden nature of sunlight holds an important key to higher human evolution. The most advanced things are always quite simple, quite natural, and the answers to them are always right in front of your face. Ancient solar yoga has nothing to do with stretching or exercise, but is the practice of receiving intelligent cosmic information through the human eye via direct solar gazing. This ascension technique is way more important and powerful than many imagine, and all we can say is, if it flew by your consciousness in the past, literally look a bit deeper now. The great central sun, the central sun, and earth sun are holders and transmitters of universal Akashic information. The Akash is the entire body of information contained in the entire universe. It is all that is, and it has been called God. Each one of these larger dimensional suns transduce Akasha, source energy all the way down through the universe and finally to planet earth since earth sun transduces energy from the central sun at 5d and since the central sun is powered by the great central sun 12d light rays from earth sun are transmitting packets of the most powerful and super intelligent energy in the universe above we simply call the packets of universal information light or light codes but here we are going to name them X-Factor. In the ancient Vedas and in the mystery school teachings and the great white brotherhood, this X-Factor energy is described as the most powerful spiritual force in the universe. X-Factor is the ambrosia of ascension and conscious evolution. It is ascension rocket fuel that will power your light body ship quickly towards home. The activation of the X-Factor causes a great change within the body, as the DNA strands necessary for the building of the light body are gradually decoded, a great deal of energy is released from the physical body. Earth's sun, gaining its energy from the two ever-larger dimensional suns above it, provides an abundant supply of this energy in the form of primary life force energy. One of the main functions of X-Factor is the activation of the primary life force centers within the human body. The chakra energy centers control the flow of the life force within the body. As the energy of the X factor increases within the body, the energy flow within the chakras increases and the dormant energy of the life force centers is released. The light of the body is the eye. The human eye is actually a miniature sun and like the suns of our solar system, it has the ability to absorb and radiate light. It absorbs X-factor energy through the retina from where it is redistributed to the brain and nervous system. We know that these energy particles are the carriers of various universal factors of energy that are capable of doing predetermined and specific work. In short, the suns of the universe are living entities, and the light from these suns of the universe are living entities, and the light from these suns is a complex carrier wave that encodes several levels of information and energy used to create and sustain life. The eye is the only exposed nerve in the human body, and when it is directly connected to the earth's sun via solar yoga, the optic nerve takes in large amounts of this universal X factor, which immediately stimulates and activates the pineal gland and the thalamus glands, which in turn begins to switch on and activate dormant DNA strands, greatly expanding consciousness near instant. Ancient traditional cultures from throughout the world had a strong awareness of the sun as a spiritual force and as a secret doorway to a higher reality. There are extensive religious, yogic, astrological, and shamanic traditions that revere the sun in various ways. They sought to understand the wisdom and grace behind its outer form, intuiting through the sun the supreme force behind all existence. The sun is the visible representation of the deity, the veritable face of the gods. The sun is the great symbol of the self, spirit, or divine presence in the world, Atman. To many cultures, it is a living divine being, and too many more. It is the ultimate god of the universe. Experienced practitioners of solar yoga often combine other ascension methods and tools, including meditation, movement, mantras, nature, and crystals with solar yoga. We invite you to revisit this ascension technique and consider how powerful it truly is. Study from the masters on the correct procedure for receiving solar information through the eye. 
After 10 minutes of direct solar yoga, you will have an immediate activation and experience an expanded state of consciousness, finding yourself in a higher dimension right where you are. Dear one, the ancient divine races of earth spoke much about this modern time. They said one special morning at dawn, the sun would pierce from the darkness, rise between the mountains and shine brighter than ever before. It was said that on this great day, humanity would live in peace and freedom and goodness forevermore. The great beings of old called this the dawn of a new day. Great light has indeed come into this world and the beings of planet earth are awakening more and more with each passing day. Know that you will see what you have been looking for and you will reach the magic goal. It shall be so on earth. Great honor to you. Keep doing your good work to create a better world. We are all doing it with you, right here beside you. You are the light of the world. Feel free to share how you are doing on your evolutionary journey. Godspeed, Michael and the Pleiadians from 5dearthproject.com Now a quick side note before I bid you all adieu. You want to be careful when doing sun gazing. You don't want to stare directly into the sun at midday or afternoon. We do not want to damage the retina. The best time sunrise, sunset, if you put your hand sideways, the width from your pinky to your thumb, the sun should be below that level in between the width of your hand to make sun gazing safe. There's many videos on YouTube and articles if you search on Google that teach this ancient practice of sun gazing. So be sure to do some research before practicing this art. If you'd like to help support us in our work and mission and help us continue bringing these transmissions to the world, you can make a monthly pledge on Patreon or one-time donation to PayPal at our links at egolovecondor.com. 441 coming in the mirror of the 144 as we bridge heaven and earth through our sacred vessel. Be sure to join us later tonight for our full transmissions and please like, comment, and share this video with your teams and tribes all over this realm. 1717 coming in of the 88 portal of the Lion's Gate double, Quelle, double source. Keep walking your sacred path with heart, with peace and love in every step. Keep shining your light brightly into the night. The eagle and the condor love you all. Namaste.